Hey, what's going on, people? Your boy, Man Mike, here coming at you guys with the update from the Atlanta Braves, Los Angeles Dodgers game tonight. Um, we just got our ass wheel. The Atlanta Braves got their stomped, smashed, and kicked. This game was over from the very start of the game, all right? I, I'm, I'm just going to be honest. Um, this is one of those games, and I've said this before, and um, actually had someone that totally disagree with what I had to say, but I think this game was lost um, last night when the Atlanta Braves um, allowed the Los Angeles Dodgers, who has a terrific lineup, okay? They have a terrific lineup. Their lineup um, is just as talented as the Atlanta Braves, but when you look at this, man, um, you can't allow these guys to get any type of rhythm, all right? And I thought having Tomlin in the game last um, last night and allowing those guys to come back and get in the rhythm, um, you got to bury these types of things. You can't allow the Dodgers to have any ounce of of hope and last night Tomlin pitching uh, absolutely horrible uh, horrific it allowed these guys to get in the rhythm and gain any type of um, it allowed them to gain confidence um, which they already is a confident team but when they're you know when you have these guys down you got to make sure these guys stay down and tonight um, from the very beginning um, I think this carried over from uh, last night's game and uh, I'm just going to be honest Kyle Wright was just absolutely horrible, all right? I know he's a, a young pitcher and the Braves are down. Um, but, again, when you have a young staff, you cannot, cannot allow the Dodgers to get any rhythm, in any type of rhythm, all right? And I'm, like I said, I'm not blaming this guy, Kyle Wright, for, you know, essentially losing the game. Um, I'm putting this more so on uh, Snicker. All right, I'm just not the biggest Snit fan. I know he makes great decisions most of the time, but there's just instances where you just have to keep a team down. You can't allow these guys. And again, I'm keep going back to that. The Braves offense, these guys have not been consistent. Um, they've been good in spots, but um, look, man, you give it up. Look, in the first freaking any okay we're talking about the first freaking inning he gave up six runs yeah the strike zone may have been a little bit tight but Kyle Wright this did not do himself any justice and the Braves are down um the Braves go down tonight 15 all right 15 runs uh, that's a lot all right just giving up 15 runs is just not a good um look at all um the game four, you have Clayton Kershaw and look, man, the Braves have to win. They must win this game if they want any opportunity to win the series, in my opinion, um, especially when the offense has been a little bit uh, shaky up and down. Ronald Acuna is not hitting. Um, hopefully he comes around. Ozzy Albee seems like he's coming around. Freddie Freeman is Freddie Freeman. Um, Ozuna, these guys are already... You know, these guys are already uh, in somewhat of a rhythm. Uh, there's a very good team, but again, when it all comes down to it, man, you have to bury these teams when you have them. And let me know what you guys think about this. Do you think this series is over? Um, the Atlanta Braves messed around and allowed the Los Angeles Dodgers to get in the rhythm. Do you think it's over? Do you think the Dodgers are going to come back and create another uh, horrific... <laughs> moment for georgia sports leave your comments below do not forget to hit the subscribe button your boy man mike is out man peace